This video will cover difficult questions regarding the topic of arithmetic sequences and series. This is the first question. It is a November 2000 HL paper 1 question. U1 equals 85. The common difference D equals 78 minus 85, which is minus 7. Un equals U1 plus N minus 1D equals 85 plus N minus 1 times D equals minus 7. Then 85 plus minus 7N plus 7, which is 92 minus 7N. So finally, 92 minus 7n must be greater than 0. Then minus 7n is greater than minus 92. Then divide by minus 7 on each side. Then n is less than 13.142. That means n equals 13. First, the 13 terms are positive terms. Sn equals n over 2 times 2u1 plus n minus 1 times d. So s13 equals 13 over 2 times 2 times 85 plus 13 minus 1, which is 12 times minus 7. Then 13 over 2 times 170 minus 84 equals 13 over 2 times 86 make the fraction 2 times 1 2 times 43 the final answer is 559 this is the november 2010 hl paper 1 question with an ap the mean of an even number of consecutive terms equals the mean of the middle terms the middle terms of the first 10 terms are the fifth and sixth terms. So, u5 plus u6 over 2 equals 6. u5 equals u1 plus 4d plus u6 equals u1 plus 5d over 2 equals 6. 2u1 plus 9d equals 12. Use the same technique. The middle terms of the first 20 terms are tens and 11 terms. The mean is u10 plus u11 over 2 equals 16. u10 equals u1 plus 9d. u11 equals u1 plus 10d over 2 equals 16. So 2u1 plus 19d equals 32. Then with these two, 2u1 plus 9d equals 12. 2u1 plus 19d equals 32. Then subtract. 9d minus 19d equals minus 10d equals 12 minus 32 means minus 20. So d equals 2. Put it here. 2u1 plus 9 times d equals 12. 2u1 plus 18 equals 12. So 2u1 equals minus 6. u1 equals minus 3. The general term un equals u1 plus n minus 1d. So u15 equals minus 3 plus 15 minus 1, which is 14 times 2, minus 3 plus 28, which is 25. This is the May 2008 HL paper 1 question. If the areas are in the arithmetic sequence, then so are the angles. So these angles, theta, then theta plus d, then theta plus 2d, go on. So first term is theta, 
then theta plus d, theta plus 2d, until 2 theta. Then this one is u1, u2, u3, and the last one is u12. Then Sn equals n over 2 times u1 plus un. So S12 equals 12 over 2 times u1 plus u12. So 6 times u1 equals theta, u12 equals 2 theta. So 6 times 3 theta means 18 theta. Then sum of the angles equals 2 pi. Then divide by h in on each side. Theta equals 2 pi over 18, which is pi over 9. This is the November 2003 HL paper 1 question. Since the terms are consecutive, the difference between two terms are the same. Then this is u1, u2, u3, and u4. Then u2 minus u1 equals u3 minus u2. a minus b minus 2 equals 2a plus b plus 7 minus a minus b. Then a minus b minus 2 equals 2a plus b plus 7 minus a plus b. A minus B minus 2 equals A plus 2B plus 7. Then cancel. Minus 3B equals 9. Then B equals minus 3. Then U3 minus U2 equals U4 minus U3. 2A plus B plus 7 minus A minus B equals a minus 3b minus 2a plus b plus 7, 2a plus b plus 7 minus a plus b equals a minus 3b minus 2a minus b minus 7. Then the left side is a plus 2b plus 7 equals minus a minus 4b minus 7. Then 2a plus 6b equals minus 14. Then 2a plus 6 times b equals minus 3 equals minus 14. So 2a equals minus 14 plus 18, which is 4. So a equals 2. This is the May 2015 SL paper 2 question. Sn equals 6n plus n squared, so S1 equals 6 plus 1 squared, which is 7. Then S2 equals 6 times 2 plus 2 squared, so 12 plus 4, which is 16. Number B, S2 equals U1 plus U2, S2 equals 16. Then u1 equals s1, which is 7, plus u2. Therefore, u2 equals 9. Number c, d equals u2 minus u1. So 9 minus 7, which is 2. Number d, u10 equals u1 plus 9d u1 equals 7 plus 9 times d equals 2, which is 25. Number e, un is greater than 1000. So un is 7 plus n minus 1 times 2 is greater than 1000. Then 7 plus 2n minus 2 is greater than 1000. So 2n is greater than 7 minus 2 is 5. 1000 minus 5 equals 995. Then divide by 2 on each side. 
and is greater than 497.5. Therefore, n equals 498. Number f, these are sn, f is sn equals 1512, sn equals 6n plus n square equals 1512, then n square plus 6n minus 1512 equals 0, then we can factor n plus 42, n minus 36 equals 0, so n equals minus 42 and 36, but this is not the answer, n must be greater than 0, therefore n equals 36. This is the last one. It is the November 2014 SL paper 2 question. This is a 3 meters. This is 1 meter each. The number A. She runs 3 meter and back 3 meters again. So A1 equals 6 meters. And then number B. She runs 4 meter and back 4 meter again, which is 8 meters. So A3 equals 10 meters. Number E, Sn equals N over 2 times 2U1 plus N minus 1D. Then 940 equals N over 2 times 2 times 6 plus N minus 1 times 2. Then times 2 on each side, 1880 equals n times 12 plus 2n minus 2. Then 1880 equals n times 2n plus 10. Then same thing equals expand. 2n squared plus 10n, then divide by 2 on each side, 940 equals n squared plus 5n, then n squared plus 5n minus 940 equals 0, then n equals 28.261 something, or minus 33. 261 something, the minus number is not the answer, so n equals 28. Number f, the number of pumpkins Peter collected is 28, the distance Peter learned to collect 28 pumpkins is 28 equals 28 over 2 times 2 times the first one, 6 plus 27 times 2, which is 14 times 12 plus 54. The answer is 924 meters. This means that Peter took the 28th pumpkin and went back to collect the next pumpkin, heard the signal and finished the game, maybe here. If this length is L, then 924 plus L makes 940. So the answer L equals 16. So the final answer is a 16 meter. I hope this video has been helpful. This is the last of three videos covering the arithmetic sequences and series. Previous lessons are linked in the description bar below. If you have any questions, please leave them in a comment. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe for more.